Hello everybody, Grace still plays, and we're back with more subsistence, no time for BS. So, a new day is upon us, and it's time to pretty much get right out there. You can see I have a new item here, I've managed to create a generator. Um, in retrospect, I probably wouldn't have created this, it doesn't really do too much yet. One of the things I really want to create is this animal housing. We need to get this thing going, like, right away, and for it we're gonna need nails and wood. So, we have to get out there and go find some nails and wood. Uh, there are some creatures nearby that I do have to take care of to not piss off. There is, however, a piece of copper ore right here that I do want to get. So, let's go ahead and grab that real fast. We're going to need to get some wood. Got three copper ore and another three copper ore from that. That is really good. I actually really like being on top of all of these ores. Oh, while we're here, let's see how our... Let's see how our fire is going. Fire's going good. I'm going to drop down one more piece of fuel in it so that it goes for a nice long time. I don't think that we can drop down there without breaking our leg. So we're not going to go ahead and do that. And when I come across trees like this, I think I'm going to go ahead and harvest them real fast. But anyway, that is my plan. To get the animal housing up as soon as possible. We have several chickens right now. And if we can start breeding them, that would be fantastic. Because I am really, really, really low on meat. And it's becoming quite annoying. Especially since I don't have that many... Uh, since I don't have that many, uh, bullets in, act in order to actually catch anything. Oh man, more copper. Holy crap, there's a lot of ore right here. I have never really seen three pieces of ore like this before. Uh, I guess we'll grab it all. Copper and then two pieces of iron ore right here. Man, this is fortunate. Now, we don't have a refinery yet, but when we do, we'll be able to smelt this stuff down to fragments so that we can use it for building materials. Okay, so in order to be able to build our animal housing, we are going to need, like, big-time boxes. I need to find- oh, what is that right there? Hold on. Little critter right over here. I wonder if it's something we can grab. Uh, it is a rabbit. I really want to breed rabbits, too. Because rabbits will generate cloth for us. That is a wolf. We don't want to go that way right now. Just because I'd really like to keep my- the few bullets that I have, rather than spend them all willy-nilly. Let's go ahead and grab all these plants, though. Oh, so good. Yes! Okay, good. A box. And I think that this is going to be a creative-style box. Yes, good. Okay, that gave us some nails, so thus we are well on our way to be able to make our animal housing. Now, I think I could go back right now and start making it, but the problem is, man, when you have light, you need to use it as soon as possible and as much as possible, because when it gets dark, it's so dark and so cold that we just can't really do very much. One of the things, one of the other reasons that I want to get some freaking rabbits breeding and having crazy rabbit sex is because we need cloth big time in order to get the rest of our clothes done. All we're wearing right now is a pair of pants. Which, needless to say, is not enough to keep a man warm. While we've got all these wood pieces, let's make sure to start moving those into planks. We want to be turning those into planks basically all the time that we can. We're also- Crap. Alright, let me go around this way. I was gonna say, we're also gonna want to check these rocky outcroppings for additional ore. Because that's where we're going to find it. This is a very unique rock structure over here. Man, I haven't seen anything like that before. Um, let me see here. We still have that one kind of wolf that's looming somewhere over there. Let's, let's continue to head this way and look around this area. See if we can find some more ore. And man, some more boxes. I need more damn boxes. Alright, we got a box in sight. We're going to not be able to go very far from our base. Uh, oh, there's another box right there as well. Let's grab both of these. Our stamina, if you can see it, is coming back super freaking slow because we do not- Oh, that is really timely. Because we do not have any meat in us right now. We need meat, like, really, really badly. Oh, wow, there's a whole slew of boxes over here. Oh, this is really, really lucky. Hold on, let me grab all of this. Hopefully there's no creatures around here that are gonna freaking waylay us while we do this. Nice! That was a couple of- Hold on, let me go ahead and stack these rounds together. We got a couple of fully made bullets there, too, which, when I was saying one time, man, I hope I get some of those full bullets, because they're so good. It just, it makes it so that we don't have to find the materials in order to make them. Oh, look at this! We got Stonehenge hanging out over here. This would have been a really cool place to make a base. Holy crap. More building crates right here, which is good. The biggest, one of the biggest issues and resources that we're gonna have is, that is a bear, is the nails. Because the nails are kind of like the, I don't know, like the limiting factor for a lot of the wood building that we're going to be doing. Okay, there's another bear over there. Holy crap, there are bears everywhere. And that's a wolf, and that's a bear. Mother of Jesus, man! Where are they all coming? They're coming out of the freaking woodwork! They're like, oh, Greylock, time to beat some ass! 
Got another little hidden box over here. Let me see if I can grab this. We got a bear right in front of us right now. We are making a ton of planks. Oh, that's so good. Water, still an issue because there's no renewable source of water in the game yet. So we're still dealing with the fact that when you run out of water, you are freaking boned beyond all possible bonedness. Um, so that's something to consider. Oh, God. What do we got going on over here? Eh, this may be a place to get some ore. This may also be a place to break your leg. So I'm going to have to be very, very careful. Also, oh, you can see we're, we're like, really hungry right now. Uh, let me go down here. There we go. That worked out fairly well, actually. Grab some more wood while we're right at this tree. Oh, grabbing the wood as it comes off the tree like a freaking baller. Of course, I missed that one. It fucking figures. All right, let's go ahead and drag one berry over to this we are, like, super malnourished, so we're gonna go ahead and drink one of these. That's gonna give us a little bit of hydration back, and it's also gonna give us a little bit of fruit. You can see our fruit and vegetables and our, our protein is super down. And I know I mentioned this before, but that's actually one of the things I like about the game. I like that you do, like, legitimately need a source of protein. I just wish that there was other sources of protein besides wolves. Someone had mentioned it kind of sucks that, like, you know, the main, the main bad guy in all these different games is always wolves. I kind of agree. I hate having to kill wolves for meat in order to survive in the game. I kind of wish that instead you could have, like, cashews or something. Hold on, we got a wolf right here. I'm gonna have to take, as, as soon as I say that, I'm gonna have to take this freaking wolf down. I feel so bad about this. But, uh, I'm sorry, buddy. There we go. Oh shit, this is bad. Whoa, that was really bad, actually. Um, I didn't- Oh, we're bleeding, too. Okay, hold on one second. We are gonna go ahead and grab what we can here. We got two stakes from that. And now let us go ahead and bandage ourselves because we're bleeding out. And I think that that's it. I don't think that there's, like, an animation or anything in this game when it comes to bleeding out. I think, like, you just, like, fix yourself and, like, like blammo, you're done. We are really, 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 really injured. Um, in fact, we are so injured that our our day is immediately cut short. We need to, we need to head back, like, ASAP. Someone had mentioned, can you hunt... With just your axe. Well, there, and I, and I had replied, that is, like, one of the worst decisions you could make. Well, now you guys know. Um, that's what happens when you try and hunt with the axe. Now, obviously, I'm not the best at hunting with the axe on top of that. Just because I'm fairly inexperienced with the game altogether. But you could pretty clearly see that the axe is, like, vastly inferior to having a nice firearm. And I ended up using all of our damn bullets for that, which I hate myself for now. But, it's a difficult game, and I do kind of like that it is a difficult game. Oh, thank goodness gracious right here. Come on, give us a freaking medical pack or something. I mean, basically anything that can help heal us. Now, you do heal over time. Um, oh, wow. That is really good. Uh, I'm going to eat that immediately. That is like a protein bar, and is one of those few ways that you can get protein in the game that's not killing creatures. Say hello to Stonehenge. We're gonna go past that. I'm gonna stay fairly close to this gate just so that nothing like really creeps up on me. I definitely want to be looking for boxes though because you can see every once in a while, man, we haven't gotten a protein bar in like forever, but every once in a while, oh shit, is that a box way out there? I can't tell from here. I don't think it is. I think it's a fern. Some of these ferns look a lot like boxes. Oh shit. Okay. All right, sorry, sorry. I'm leaving. You win. Uh, we are not in any condition to shit. He's got to be right on the other side of this freaking wall. Um, okay, we're gonna like, we're gonna like, press ourselves right against this grate in order to not die. Yep, there he was, right there, right on the other side of the, right on the other side of the, um, that rock right there was that that friggin' wolf. I told you, man. They can hide on you. And the next thing you know, they're springing out, freaking delivering a, a, a fucking elbow drop to your ass, and you don't even know what happened. We are epically tired right now. We can't even run. There is, however, some fibers over here that I want to grab. There we go. Again, anytime you see fibers, man, you are going to want to snag those ASAP, because fibers, again, are used for damn near everything in this game. 
you can see we're not even regaining. We are not even regaining stamina anymore. So uh, this walking gait right now is as fast as I can go. I can't even sprint. That's kind of one of the things that annoys me in the game. How well, I kind of get it. Like, you know, if you're malnutrition and all this other stuff, like you're not going to be able to move very quickly. But for the playability of the game, I kind of hate it. Just because, like, the worst thing about games is not being able to move very quickly around the map. And I can cut it out for you guys, but for me, it's a pain in the balls. All right, we do have another crate over here. Ooh, is this one of those locked crates? I've really been waiting for, like, a locked crate. I don't think it is. That's all right, though. Um, this is one of the building crates. Wow, that was a freaking slew of electronics. Um, I will, I will gladly accept all the electronics. Jesus! What was that, four pieces of electronics in that single crate? The electronics are used for all of, like, the more advanced items in the game. Now, every once in a while, there's, like, a bear and or wolf that likes to spawn right next to our... Yep, right there. I called it! I was gonna say, right next to our base. And of course there's one! Of course there is! Oh, you bastard! Why do you do this to me? Now I have to crawl my happy ass. Crawl my happy ass over to the base and pray that it does not find me. I think we pretty much made it at this point. Oh, Christ. It's actually walking this way, too. Um, all right. I think we are in. Okay, good. Go ahead and use this real quick. We are going to cook both of these delicious steaks. We're going to go over here to the fat. We're going to burn this down. We've got eight additional biofuel right now. So let's go ahead and let those cook. Go over here. Put the, Look at how much biofuel we have. This is so nice. Uh, over here, let's go ahead and start with animal housing. Yes. Good. We have just enough power and just enough mass in order to do this. Now, the generator, the reason the reason that we have this and can actually use it for some stuff is... Let me go ahead and I'm going to split this a little bit. We're going to bring this over here. Open up the generator. Throw this in. Turn it on. And there you go. The generator is now providing basically power for the entirety of the base. And you can see right here, the power is going up like really fast. Um, but the only problem is to make almost everything, you need mass as well, which is a pain in the ass. Plant beds. Oh, we're going to want that. But we need 100 mass in order to make it. I've got a couple of things that we can use. Um, look, at actually, all this stuff needs mass. Oh, well, the hammer only needs some mass. Well, that's nice. Um, okay, animal housing is done. Boom. This, we don't have to worry about. We can, like, turn this off for right now. So, I'm not too worried about that. Uh, inside of here, how are our steaks doing? They are looking good, man. Looking good. Cook steaks right there. Go ahead and grab these, and oh my god, we're going to scarf these down, like, right away. Oh, so good. I'm so sorry, Wolf, that you turned into food for our cause. That is going to pump our proteins way up. Well, way up. Just enough so that we're not starving anymore. I love this fuel-burning stove, too, because the fuel lasts forever. It's so much better than what we had. Okay, now that we have our chicken coop, let me go ahead and find a place that I want to put this down. Uh, I'll put this over here. And let's check this out. We're going to build our base out this way. So I think for now we're just going to like put our chicken coop over by... I don't know. We'll just put it over here. I'm not really sure how big I want this thing right now. Let's go ahead and grab our chickens and put them in. I don't think that I have to crouch any longer. Our health should be coming back way faster too. Which I'm really excited about. Come here, chickens. All you chickens were just hanging out in the storage bin. You don't need to feed them, luckily. This game isn't that realistic. Uh, okay, good. And can I, like, just throw you in here? Yes, I can. Okay, chickens, start procreating and do whatever you do. Uh, shit. They need food and water, huh? Um, hmm. And what are the upgrades for this? Go free range. Animals can roam around the housing and consume less food and water. Allows them to reach level 10. So we need fragments for that. And if we install a feces tray, which is kind of interesting, it will give us the ability to get fertilizer. Okay, that's fine. Um, so food and water, huh? Uh, all right, well, oh God, I don't want to use all my water. Let me go ahead and split one here and see what this does. If we put this there, what happens? Uh, you added some water. Okay, and if we split one of these, what happens? Do these guys even eat this kind of stuff? 
Huh. I guess so. That's interesting. They eat blueberries. Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and do a couple more of those. Actually, keeping these guys alive is going to be really, really important. I'm going to use... Oh, God. All right. I'm going to go ahead and put, like, three of these in there. I wonder what else they eat. Um, let's go ahead and give them a little bit more water, too. Again, this is kind of rough just because water is kind of a pain in the ass to get. All right. So our chickens are doing good. Let's... You know what? Let's do a couple things. Let's um, let's go on the hunt for some chickens and more boxes. We still have plenty of daylight left, and we gotta use it as best we freaking can. All right, man, it's like to hunt for Red October, but for chickens. Come on, you chickeny bastards. Where the hell are you? Oh, I want like eight of you in there. I want you all breeding and procreating and making me freaking eggs. Because, I don't know, I imagine eggs are protein. So hopefully we can eat them? Oh boy. It's a chicken. The only problem is, is that we are, like, really, really low on vegetables. We have some. There's also a bear right over there, so I may just let that chicken lie. Leave the chicken where it lies for now. Ooh, box. Hold on. Let's grab this box, though. Oh, man, another box, too. Okay, this is nice. It's, it's interesting that, like, these boxes end up being next to one another a lot of the time. I should have dropped a lot of this stuff back off at the base. I'm carrying way too much equipment on me to go out like this. That's an apple. That is good. The apple is worth a lot of fruit and vegetable nutrition. And I... Oh, shit. Hold on. We got a wolf right there. And I got a box right over here that I really want to get. How close can I get to this? Um, hold on. All right, that wolf seems to be walking away. Oh, you fucker. Don't you do it. 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 Fuck you. Oh, don't you do it, wolf. Out of the way, chicken. Out of the way. You're not still following me, are you, wolf? Okay, good. All right, that was kind of lucky because that wolf apparently did not want anything additional to do with us. Probably because of our great prowess. Live in fear, wolf. Live in fear for now. Someone had mentioned that uh, wolves are... There's probably no way that I would ever be able to kill a wolf. And I think you're right. Well, I know you're right. Um, I had read somewhere that wolves, as pack animals, which is quite interesting, will always... If they're going to attack something, they will always do so with a clear advantage in a way that will reduce... Jeez, there's like wildlife everywhere over here that will reduce the potential for injury to the pack at to as little as humanly, well, as wolfly as possible. So I thought that was cool. Like, in nature, there's no cheating. You know what I mean? Like, if I was an animal and I was hungry, I would do what it took to beat the other animal. I, I wouldn't care if I had to, like, stalk it or fool it. If I won, that's what counts. <laughs> More bears, more wolves. This pathway is an absolute freaking nightmare. Oh my god. There is stuff everywhere. Oh, there's a bear right there. Oh god. Traversing this is going to be very, very difficult. We are we have creatures on all sides of us. Um, I'm going to go right through here. That is an iron ore node, but I am surrounded by creatures. And I really don't feel like dying right now. Because when you die, you lose all your shit. And that... Makes continuing a let's play very difficult. <laughs> because then I have to find a way to get my stuff. Which will not be easy. This pathway, though, is kind of interesting. I wonder... Uh, tempt fate, tempt fate. No, don't tempt fate, Gray. Don't do it. Do not do it. Just take what you can get and be on your way. In fact, now that we have a lot of energy, I'm going to go ahead and start sprinting now and again. Ever since we managed to eat a little bit, we're doing a lot better on energy, which I'm very happy about. Oh, this is a large rock structure. Um, I'm going to go on the other side of this just to see if there's anything in it. We're going to start, like, doubling up on our areas in the map right now because I think we've been around the entire map. Also, the sun is going to start setting, so that's going to be a problem. This is a box. So we're going to want this right now. That is a wolf dead, dead ahead as well. So let's go ahead and grab this. Another protein bar. That was really fortunate. Um, is that another box over there? If it is, I may even kind of skirt around this rat bastard a little bit in order to get it. Yep, it's a box. Um, that is a chicken over there. Anything else over here? No. <sighs> Come on, wolf. Turn. Yes, thank you very much. I was going to say, freaking turn the other cheek, man. Didn't your parents ever tell you? 
Turn the other cheek. Don't you turn back this way. I will hate you for it. Uh, yep, I'm going to hate you for it. All right. Oh, God. Uh, okay, another one right over here. Oh, crap. Holy cow. I, man, some of this stuff is just caught in the grass, and I didn't even see it. Uh, okay, this is good. Let's go ahead and start crafting these. We've got a couple more rounds that we can get to. We're up to six now. Six and seven is pretty much what's it. Wow, we just got some seeds, too. Um, man, I don't want to leave this. I do not want to leave this. Let me see if we can grab this without fighting this thing. Yes! Okay, he's starting to kind of walk away. Yes! Walk away! You don't want any of Grey still plays, baby. I may be a fox, but I can still put up a fight. Boom! Alright, got it. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. We're leaving. We are leaving with great expedient power. Oh, motherfucker. Okay, good. Excellent. Oh, man. Oh, this game! I do, I, man. I do like the look of the game, though. Some people have said it's an ugly game, man. I don't know. Uh, the game looks pretty damn good, uh, from what I've seen. Where in the name of Jesus is our base? Because, yep, there it is. All the way on the other side of the map. Right where I left it. Very good. Alright, well, let's start hoofing it on over there. Uh, this will give us an opportunity to find more boxes, bitch! There we go. Uh, yes, biofuel and more water. Man, we are getting stacked with water. Oh, it w I would freaking hate to die right now. So let us not do that, if at all possible. In fact, I'm thinking about chopping some wood, but I'm thinking better of it, and I'm not going to chop wood, because I would rather us get to our base as quickly as possible. Because the one second in this game you're chopping wood, and the next second in this game the freaking sun is down. That is a giant ass bear. And you're getting your ass beat. Alright, grab this box over here. Nice, another protein bar. And is that a box over there? Nope, that is just landscaping. Oh, shit. Where is my beacon at? Shit! That is wolf. There's my beacon. Holy crap, I was facing the wrong direction. Okay. Let's keep going this way. Uh, our stamina, not too bad right now. I, Man, I hate cresting hills in this game. Because it's always a surprise on what's on the other side. Man, I haven't gotten any blueberry bushes in a little bit. Um, do I want to get this? Yeah, let's go ahead and get it. It's right here. Alright. I hope I don't <laughs> I hope I don't hate myself for this. I assume another three pieces of copper ore, five pieces of copper ore, actually. Head down here, no bears and wolves, very good. Uh, yep, the, okay, it's gonna start getting night very, very quickly. We need to sprint the entirety of the way if we can. Uh, that is a bear right over there. Oh, God. fuck. Sorry, bear. Sorry, bear. I don't want any of it. I don't want any of it. I don't want any of it. You're the man. You are the man. You are the bear. Shit! All right, another bear over there. Oh, God, the sun's going down. Oh, the sun is going down in paradise. This is so bad right now. Um, okay. Okay, go this way. There's a wolf. Two wolves right over there. All right, let's see if we can sprint through all this wildlife right now. Oh, God! Okay, that worked out fairly well. Oh, that's a box over there. I'm just gonna leave it. Uh, oh, how far are we from our freaking base? Probably another... Oh, it's gonna be dark by the time we get there. Absolutely, it's gonna be dark by the time we get there. Oh, this is so bad. Um... Okay, that's a bear over there. I just want to cover as much ground as I can. That is a box over there. Oh, I kind of want to get that freaking box. Oh, shit. Mm. Oh, we're so slow right now. Okay, good. I can see our base. Um. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get it. Okay. This is what it's all about. Yes! Okay, that was a lot of electronics, so that was a pretty damn good box. That is a wolf over there. I'm just moving nice and slow right now to kind of stack up our stamina. I think there's a box right over there along with a... Fuck. Oh, there's a bear right there as well. Um, okay. Let me think about this. Let's crouch down. And... Oh, there's a plant right here for some fibers. That's kind of interesting. I can't believe I saw this in this low light. Let me see if I can get up to our base here without dying. You can see our fire is still raging, which is good. Well, I say fire. Our stove. All right, man. Woo! We made it back to the base nice and warm. 
it gets real cold at night here, so it's kind of a pain in the ass. Let's go ahead and put a couple of our things in here. What do I want to put in here? Uh, this protein par, I'm actually going to eat one of these because we need the protein big time. I am going to eat a couple of these apples too. Oh, it's so good. Yes. All right, I'm going to put that in there because we don't need that. We don't need these rifle rounds right now either because they're not really doing anything for us. All this ore we can put in here. We don't need that. Um, we have a lot of gunpowder right now. A lot of gunpowder right now. I wonder if I can make any bullets with this. Uh, no, I can't. Huh. All right. How are our chickens doing? Let's go ahead and grab our axe because you never know when you might need it. And hopefully our chickens have leveled. If they've leveled, maybe we can grab some freaking eggs off of them right over here. Um, right, I'm going to put a little bit more food and water in here so these chickens get kind of healthy. Um, we are really, really cold right now, so I do have to deal with that. I even gave him an apple. Ugh. I hope that, I hope that these freaking chickens pay off, because if they don't, I'm going to be really sad about that. We got to get right next to our fire, though, because holy crap, it's cold outside. Let me see if we can do any more building for the base. All right, we've got another wall made, so we can finally make all four walls, which is kind of nice. I guess I'll go ahead and snap this in, snap this in. Really? Can I not? Oh, shit. Hold on. Holy cow. Went a little bit wonky there. Uh, there we go. Snap that in. Do I want a window on this side? Actually, I kind of do. Eh, I already made this full wall. I'm not going to worry about it. We can probably change it later. Oh, come on. Snap again, you bastard. There we go. All right, so we got our wall, and now let's go ahead and make a roof real quick. We've got just enough for a roof. And we are going to have our tiny, tiny, sad little house. But, man, it's better than nothing. Plus, it's going to keep us a lot warmer inside of here having this. Um, and then as time goes on, we can kind of make a better and better base, I think. There we go. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and put this thing on if we can. I may have to go outside for this. Let's see, does this snap all the way? There we go. Bam. All right. There we go. Now we just have to probably get a door, I would assume. It goes from 16 to... It goes from 16 to 12. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, it's 16 right by the fire over here. All right, sweet. So we've done it. Morning is coming. We've kind of worked through the night, but that'll set us up for the next episode. We now have an animal housing area where some chickens are hopefully going to gain some damn levels. You can see, I assume that's their experience down there. So they'll get there eventually, and then we will, I don't know, I guess uh, have some food. We got some tomato seeds. So I'm going to want to get some planting beds set up, and I think we may even have enough power in order to get one done. Uh, yeah, we just need a ton of planks, so we'll do that next time. Guys, hope you're enjoying some assistance. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.